We ask Keakua to come to be our, our special guest to guide us all so that our eyes may be open to what is important. But we do it in ha'a ha'a, in humility, so that knowledge can be passed, concerns may be noted, and that action may be taken for the best of our aina in being good stewards to our ivi kupuna and our cultural practice, in our gathering rites, and in our being good stewards to malama the aina. Has been constructed. Most people have not had for a shoreline management area. You're supposed to get due notice for due process to uh, have a, a discussion on what's going on. Okay, why why did I choose this particular spot? This is an indicator, an indicator of Article 12, Section 7. We shall not overrate. Oh, uh, we shall not. Uh, 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 overtax or overregulate Hawaiian cultural practice, Article 12, Section 7. Being a kahuna of the ocean, kahuna omaka, kahuna okekai, olimo, right here is where we collected these shells in 1999. Right here in this little culvert, you see all of this little uh, collection of stones during the 27th, 29th, 30, 31st, and 1st of the new moon, all of this stuff comes up. Out of the full moon, your leho, your big clunky ones come up. For us kahunas, we know what moon to go looking for this stuff. It gets filtered. Now why is this important to us? They live off of our limu. The more there are, the more there's limu in the ocean. We don't even have to go in. We know what particular niihau shell lives on what limu. So the health of this shell is an indicator species of the health of the limo in the ocean. I don't have to go in there to know the inventory and census of the health of our limo. I just have to look on the beach. They're right in front of me here. When you don't see these puppies anymore, that tells you a lot. It tells you where's the food source, what's happening. This place was known as Hale o Limo, the house of limo. Why? because we have natural karst systems. Two main ones, they're here, okay? Comes right down, two big caves, sites of Oahu, Waipo Uli Cave system, okay? Hono Uli Uli is not named Hono Uli Uli because they're looking at Uuloa Pearl Harbor, no way. Site, place name, Mana Inoa, Hawaiian name, what's below the ground, that Hawaiians know, what's on the ground and its usage, what Hawaiians know, or what's floating in the air that Hawaiians know. Kalawao, the gathering of the clouds, okay? In Lehui, Lehui, that cold, chilly wind from the north of Kauai, that Lehui is connected to Hawaii, uh, Kauai. That's why there's a Waipo'uli cave here and a Waipo'uli cave on Kauai. The Maveke Lakona, Blue Blood Hawaiians. They're buried in these caves. They're my ancestors. They're the Ivi Kupuna that we're trying to save. This is the 1928 map that shows where the water hole is. That's the outlet of this Waipo Uli cave system. Why would the Hawaiians dig through 10 feet of coral to put Ivi Kupuna? They never did. What did they do? They found the caves and grandma's six inch, five inch Nihokalawa was found at the entrance of Waipo Uli Cave. Her coupe, all made from whale tooth. Beads and buttons from 1796. Chinese beads. Now this is supposed to be at SHPD down at Kapolei, fifth floor. Where is it? It's in the Parks Department downtown. Why? That's a good question. I went to uh, Senator He's committee to complain why, where Jordan Muffin took these pictures when they found our Ivi Kupuna on January 5th, 2001. Why is it her pictures taken by state taxpayer money is not in the library? where it should be. Why is it hidden in the Parks Department? As a lineal descendant, I'd like to know that. Just for best practices, we 
have articles uh, here about the sinkholes. What are sinkholes? You know, the car system is created by this stuff over hundreds of thousands of years. The plumbing of our island is pahoy hoy lava tubes, as we see on the big island. They create underground plumbing. And what goes in the underground? It's drainage. Very important when you want to develop something, you gotta have drainage. You can't live in a marsh. So when that drains, and over thousands of years of ice ages creating shelves of calcium carbonite, they build up. But the rain that comes down is heavy in acid. And what does acid do to calcium carbonite? It eats through it. So as you have higher rain levels, they eat a lot. Lower rain levels, they eat a little. So you get shelves. As hundreds of thousands of years of progressions take place, you have shelves. That's where they put the Ibi Kupuna. These Waipu'uli caves, coincidentally, are over every heiau that comes through because they are the entrance to the natural cave system. So when you're going to put the ali'is in there, you're not going to let everybody know where to get their family ki'is or where to get their niho palawas or where to get their ahu'ulas. You're going to cover it up. They represent the gods, especially the highest Mabeke Lakona line, the lords of Lehui. Okay, so principally, this is not available to everybody for a good reason. Tapu! Okay, but now with development, it's got to come out. In the October, Hawaiian Historic Preservation Council unanimously passed my resolution to do underground mapping of this very important cultural value site. Why? Because that fresh water makes the limu grow. Ealae, moi moi hi moi, wake up! Without that, all the fishing poles you see here wouldn't be what attracts the fish, the limu. 80 varieties out here. Used to be two feet high, 82. You could just pick from the shore. When was the last time you could pick from the shore? April 14th, 1999, right over there. I was there the last time, okay? So why is this of cultural importance? The state constitution protects it. That's why best practices. Now let's, let's look. If there are a car system, and according to Stewart Engineering, page nine, section 5.D, it says this place is loaded with fissures, caves, cars, and what you think is going to percolate down through that from our mountains? The water that makes Haleo Limu. So why is this so important? Why is fishing important? Why is Limu important? Why is Opihi important? Why is this important? Because it's our culture. We were raised with this. I grew up with Grandpa having Palu in his refrigerator, Opi Limu Koho. So you're going to take that away from me where the state constitution says no can do? Am I going to sit on my tiny? No. But how can we protect this stuff that people don't know about? Hidden treasures are no good if they're hidden and destroyed. Came, went, who knew? So we have to protect these treasures. That's why we're here. Okay. So to see the value. Now, in Joseco's golf course from Ocean Point here, their pond sites, do you see them pumping water to make those fish ponds? Did they concrete that? No, they lifted up the cap rock, cap rock. Hono Uli Uli is a big water reserve underneath the ground. Not looking at Pu'uloa Pearl Harbor that's gray. How can you protect Pu'uloa? This garnery, but the big water reserve under there is what makes Haleo Limo over here. One plus one equals two, A plus B equals C. Logic. All the archaeologists say the same thing. Fishers, cars, caves, plenty of water come through here. Same thing with uh, Eva Marina, plenty fresh water coming through there. 